Well, people across the country are hoping to join the Millionaires Club tonight with more than a billion dollars up for grabs. Oh, that's a lot of money. The massive jackpot has many of us, you know, dreaming big. Let's go to CBS 2's Lauren Posen live in Chino Hills where that last billion dollar ticket was sold. Good morning, Lauren. Where's the line? Good morning, Chris. Well, not yet. The tickets will go on sale at 6 o'clock, but we've already had a couple customers come in here wanting to buy, but it's not time yet. But people are hoping to get lucky here because look above the counter. They have this huge sign, the luckiest 7-Eleven in the world, and that's because back in 2016, uh, this is where a winning ticket was sold for the largest jackpot in U.S. lotto history, and people are really hoping for a repeat. So what I have here is a bu I bought a bunch of tickets. It's for my family and my friends. So the jackpot for tonight's drawing is worth more than a billion dollars. The odds of winning are roughly 300 in 2 million to 1. But that's still not stopping people from coming out and giving it a shot to uh, be a big winner here. But, you know, as with everything, scammers are also hoping to cash in, too. We spoke with a consumer uh, security expert, and they're seeing that they're uh, seeing a huge spike in lotto scams from bogus websites claiming to sell mega million tickets to texting scams promising you're going to win big. Now, the most common scam, according to a digital safety company, is that they're going to tell you that you won the jackpot either over by phone or by text. And in those scams, they're asked to maybe make some kind of prepayment, you know, pay your taxes up front or give us a, a temporary payment in exchange for a much bigger payment later. And of course, the temporary payment is made, but the bigger payment never shows up. So despite uh, the shop being one of the luckiest in the world, the sign just can't keep up because look on the Mega Millions portion. It's stuck at 999 million. There's just not enough space for all those numbers. So tickets go on sale here at 6 a.m. And then it goes until 7 p.m. tonight, and then that's it. And um, we'll see who wins tonight. Now, coming up in our next half hour, I'm going to break down for you. If you were to win big, what are some of the big ticket items you could buy? I've got a great list for you coming up in under 30 minutes. Back to you. How fun is that?